Welcome everybody, Marcus Stone here. In this video, you will learn how you can easily add PayPal donation button to your YouTube channel. So let's start. First, what you want to do is just right here to your search PayPal.me. And you will get it here and you want to create your PayPal me link. Click on it. And now I will just log in here. And now create a PayPal me profile and share your link. Get started. First, add your photo. You know what I'm going to use. I could use one of mine here, like this one here. It's when I was working in sales. Or I can use Baby Yoda. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to use Baby Yoda. Yeah, I know you want it to be serious, but you know how it works. So Baby Yoda it is. Save. Now, PayPal me, choose your link. Uh, Marcus Stone. Marcus Stone 1, next. I agree, okay. Agree and continue. Your link is ready to share. Okay, copy. And now let's try to paste it here. And voila. So here we got it. And now how we can add it to your profile. So what I recommend are two things. Add it to your this description and also add it here. So again, customize channel. Let's go to about, links, add, PayPal donation, okay, done, and voila, here we got it, if someone's going to click, here is here, and the second way, what do I recommend, add it to your description also here if you want, but go to videos, and I don't know, I have a video here, and edit video, and voila, just add it wherever you want. So like, you can support me here. And voila, you got it. And then just click save. So like, if I also show you one of the guys who make it like that, is that how he's called? Oh, Dr. John Campbell. And he has it, look at this. To donate this project, please use the link below. And it's the same thing. Look at this. Donate to Dr. John Campbell. And you can also make it monthly donation here. So this is how you actually make it. And it's quite easy. And at the end of the video, I recommend guys, like I'm going to read you a quote I really liked. It's this one. If you don't care to be liked, they can't touch you. How important it is to not caring to be liked isn't it i think it's so damn important to not try to be liked by everybody because if you're gonna uh be want to like i want to be liked by everybody you are going to expose yourself your you're like i'm pretending because there are going to people that you won't like and it's completely normal and logical to don't like them and also many times you need to be defensive you need to defend yourself in life because if the snake is going to attack you, as Jordan Peterson would say. If they're going to attack you, you need to defend yourself. Because you were defending yourself for millions of years. So it's understandable. So that's like really, really important. And then I got like... That's me. Oh, man is not worried by real problems so much as by his imagined anxieties about real problems. This is so true. Something is going to happen and it, you, it's not even a problem, but it's creating in your mind. This is really important to try and work on yourself not to do that. To heal yourself from this overthinking all the time, to trying to be perfect and trying to have everything in your own way. As they say, let the chips fall and let it be as it should be. Just make the impact and let it go. It's really important. And also, if you try to work, like be in the moment, only in the moment, everything is going to be perfect. It's like, because in every moment, you are going to work on yourself, right? So, oh, this is it. True happiness is to enjoy the present without anxious dependence upon the future. Not to amuse ourselves with either hopes or fears, but to rest satisfied with what we have, 
which is sufficient for he that is wants nothing. God damn. God damn. I don't have words for this, but you get an idea. So that's kind of it. Thank you very much everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, you can support me, subscribe, you know how it works. So thank you and goodbye.